Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade! And I said we were gonna walk back, but I didn't because I accidentally let the time go again, so I didn't want to waste all that time to get back there, but we'll pick up some stuff on the way here. And besides, we can stop here and fish, actually. Well, not here. God, what did I just walk in here for? Well, okay, we haven't been in here, so I'll, I'll show you this. Real quick, this is Fuge Forest. We can't get in there yet, that door's locked. This is definitely something we can do later, though. Don't worry about that. There's lots of things you have to unlock in this game. A, a series of events and a chain of things. Yeah, we'll still have to feed our calf when we get back, so I guess I'll get to show you how to do that anyways. But, we're gonna do a little bit of fishing, because why not? Let's try it out. Find our fishing rod here. Old fishing rod. Da -da -da. Just toss it down here. For plunk. Now, you guys won't be able to see this exactly, but it'll, it'll shake on my Wii Remote when we get a bite make a little bit of a buzzing noise, but you guys probably won't be able to hear that unless I hold it right up to the mic like this. We'll see if that works. Of course, I don't know if we'll get any bites, to be honest. As he was saying, like, the waters are dull, right? Yeah, we didn't get anything there. Let's try one more time over this way. Well, we'll try a couple more times. Ooh, I think we might have something here. Let's see. Oh, here we go. I think you press the button fast and try to catch whatever it is. What have we got here? Oh, a steelhead. That's a big fish. Those are actually worth kind of decent money, I think, so you might want to invest into doing this in the beginning. So don't forget to talk to Toby down there by the lake. You'll need to be introduced to him anyways, but... Oh, what? Oh, come on, I was pressing that like mad. Oh, shoot. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, yeah, I have to stop. I didn't realize my stamina. Wow, good thing they good thing they let me know. Oh, wow, that would have been embarrassing if I fainted there. I'm sorry. That was terrible. I hope I can actually feed our animal without using stamina. 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 I'm pretty sure you can. But you see down there, she's got the tired eyes. At least we didn't faint. That would have been horribly embarrassing. My goodness. We got quite a bit done today. You can do a decent amount of stuff in a day's a day's work in this game. But yeah, in the beginning, like I said, it's going to be slow. It's an introduction. They gotta walk you through some stuff. I'm sure most of you haven't played this before, so... It's probably new to you, at least. Yeah, he's hungry. Oh, it's already in there. Cool. So what you have to stand like, it has- you literally have to be directly in front of them when you feed them. If you put it in the wrong spot, like next to them, they will not eat it. I don't know why that is. You think they could just, you know, move over a little bit and snack on it, but they don't do it. That's really annoyed me sometimes when I put it in the wrong part of the trough. So unfortunate. Oh, it's a little early to go to bed yet. Maybe we should go pick up some stuff from beaches and things. Do we have room or should we put some stuff in here first? I'm pretty sure it doesn't take stamina to do that. Sell that. I'm gonna sell this. I think it's worth at least a bit of money. And we need money, because we still gotta pay 5000 back sometime. Oh, that nice peaceful music. But yeah, once it really starts getting late, like to the 22-23, it's 
o'clock, then you want to go home because you want to get indoors before midnight, I believe. Okay, there's nothing here. Check this side. So exciting, I know. Oh, nothing. Poo poos. Hoping there'd be some stuff. Oh, here's some. Blueberries. Raspberries. Hooray. I guess that's it for that. But yeah. You can find little things like that if you look around. I'm pretty sure we picked up all the sea urchins on that other beach already. Not the one all the way down in Harmonica Town, but I don't want to walk all the way down there. Because that would take too long and then we probably would not get to bed in time. And that would not be good to do when we just have this tiny sliver of health here. Stamina Nile. Purple herb. You can eat herbs, but they don't really do much. Later on when I have the... Uh, the thing that makes juices and coffee and things, I'll make tea with those. What's this? Water's too cold. What? Oh, well, you mean she won't take a bath because the water's too cold. That's strange. Not to mention unhealthy. Unsanitary. Yeah, there's a pond here you can fish in, too. We'll do more fishing tomorrow. This is another plot of land you can buy later. Got a nice shipping box there and a water thing already. I will eventually buy those plots of land, you know, when I have the money. But yeah, I think we did most of all we can do today. Let's put those fruits in there. Yeah, later on you can do stuff like make jams and juices with those two. It's pretty cool. Alright, so all in a day's work. I almost said all in a day's twerk there. I'm sorry, I have no idea why. But... Okay, we're gonna sleep. She's obviously tired. I didn't think... Hey, we got some money. Cool. Wait, how did it say- how much did it say we got from fishing? I thought steelheads were worth more than that. Oh, someone's here. Oh, good! Yay! Glad to hear it! Now we can go to Garmin Mines! And he just disappears out of our house just like that. We're gonna save here because I haven't saved in a while. Oh, it's raining today! Thankfully I don't think anything happens if you don't have rain protection in this game. So we're not gonna worry about that. Hooray, we've reached day four, guys. Amazing! Oh yeah, on rainy days, you don't have to water your crops. Don't even worry about it. It's not a problem, which is good because that'll save us a lot of stamina. That's a good thing. Oh hey, look! Tulips. Can we pick these? We can! Okay, cool, we got some tulips. You can give these as uh, gifts to people. I gotta remember who likes tulips. I think there's even someone that loves them. Oh, I bet these are ready. Oh, a perfect one. Oh, perfect potatoes. And a good potato. Oh man, I almost want to save those, but... I'm gonna save the good potato. I remember there's something we need a potato for, but I can't remember what it was. We can't get those yet, can't get those yet, okay. Oh good, now we get to try out the sickle here. I can find it. Where is it? There it is. Okay, took me long enough. Goodness. 
I recommend that you use targeting for this because if you miss and you take out one of your crops, it's gone. You can't undo it. You're done, son. Wow, more weeds. I thought you could only get like three of those a day. Well, we know what to do with those. Okay, there we go. So we took care of that. Now I'm going to show you one more thing in here. See that good potato that I kept? We're going to go and we're going to put it in here. This is our toolbox. Put stuff in it. I don't know why you can put food items in here, but you know, we'll deal with that. That's good. Uh, what else do we want to put away? Oh yeah, I put stuff in here when I'm done with it for the day. Like, we're not going to need the watering can today. We're not going to need the hoe today. Ah, uh, we might need that today, so I'm going to leave it there. We're done with this. If I do need them, you know, it's easy to come back and get them later, but you want the free spaces in your rucksack. We're definitely going to use that. And, uh, I'm going to go use this quick and then I'm going to put it away. I'm going to move this up here, just to be a little more orderly. <laughs> so we'll go say good morning to our little calf. And I think it's either like 15 or 30 days before it becomes a cow, something like that. It could be 30, I think it takes a little longer, like a full season, for them to grow up. You're hungry again. Okay, okay, I know, you know, animals get hungry. It's a thing. It's a thing that all living things do. That way. Okay, now I'm down to eight feeds. You do not want to put your animals out on rainy days. Rainy, snowy, anything like that. Don't put your animals outside. They will not be happy with you. Just a little tip for you there. Okay. So, we can go up to Garmin Mines now. So why not? Let's go take a... A little gander up that way. I think there's one or two people we'll be introduced to new here. Up here. A few at least. Then maybe we'll get some fishing done. And not lose all our stamina like an idiot. Maybe we should buy some seeds too. Wait, I wonder if they're closed on Wednesday. Yeah, you have to pay attention to what shops are open on what days. And, and follow that accordingly. Because if you really need something on a certain day and they're not open, that can really be a kick in the face sometimes. <laughs> Trust me, I've done it, you'll do it, everyone will do it. Hi, Bo. You're welcome. Ooh, a mushroom. Take that. Thankfully, things like this stack so I don't have to worry about each mushroom taking up room. It automatically stacks together if it's the same kind. Okay, so now we finally get to visit the Garmin Mines. We'll meet some new people up here. Nice looking place. She's wild by it anyways. <laughs> okay, so the harvest goddess is this way, just up ahead. Well, we're gonna say hi to these peoples first. Okay, never mind, I don't think it's open yet. Yeah, it's not open until 8, that's soon, but you know... Uh, he's been bugging us, so... We'll do it. Oh, I wanted to pick that up. Hey. Hey. 
Hey! Uh oh. Wow, um. Okay, I really don't think they want us going in the forest. <laughs> Not all the animals are friendly, apparently. Wow, that's one angry freaking monkey. Yeah, um, I don't think we should try to walk by them, to say the least. Yeah, they're just going to tell you, stand up and speak English. I'm surprised they're not all outright attacking. <laughs> hmm, anyone who understands animals? I think they're trying to give you a clue there, but I actually don't remember. I think it might be actually someone in the Garmin mines who tells us how we deal with that. But... Okay, this place is open. No These places must all open at like 8, so... There's a shipping box over here, so I'm gonna put some stuff in it. What the hell's that? Oh. There we go. Okay. Another mushroom over here? Yep. Now sometimes mushrooms will grow throughout the day, so if you picked up some before and you check later, they might be back. Or there might be, you know, like one or two. It's all random. Okay, we're gonna sell that. Oh, I forgot to put the brush away. Oh well. What's up, Bo? What's this? Special enough to get its own little segment here. Oh, it's busted. Yeah, you want to get this fixed so you can get easily from here to Harmonica Town. It's useful when you're doing like daily stuff and you want to talk to people and give them presents. If but you don't want to make the trek from here back to your house, back all the way back over to Harmonica Town. Oh good, things should be open now, so okay, we'll start here since this is the nearest place. The blacksmiths! Hard at work, I see. Sup, dude? Ramsey. Yep, you can get your tools upgraded here. Well, eventually. Because they apparently have problems with the fire. <laughs> I'm never not gonna find that ridiculous. Well, like he said, it's the strangest thing. Okay, okay, fine. But yeah, we'll get the we'll get the chance to upgrade some stuff soon. Alright, his grandson. That's uh That's another bachelor, I believe. There's two bachelors up here actually. You can upgrade your stuff with ores. We can't do that quite yet. Because we can't. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need a hammer, I think, to break rocks and stuff. What's this place? Got a big ring out front. Maybe it's jewelers. The accessory store. And time for panoramic view? Yep. Oh boy, another person that looks depressed. <laughs> that's not a girl, by the way, that's a boy. That's actually one of the uh, bachelors, believe it or not. Well, sorry. Oh, I wonder if this is connected to, uh, Mira's husband, maybe? 
<laughs> yeah, that's what I think too, Molly. Yep, he's got sparklies. That's right. No, I'm a rancher. Well then why'd you say that? Oh yeah, Mira's husband was the owner, okay. Well I get why she doesn't want to take it over, I mean. Or doesn't want to deal with it, I mean she's still mourning her husband. We're really running out of time, come on dudes. Talk to all the dudes. might run a little longer than usual, but I'm sorry if it does. But I want to get through this part. So we can be fully introduced to all the different places in this game, at least. The general store. You can get home appliances and furniture and things here. So you seem like a peppy lady. Barbara! Oh boy, it's still our birthday. Every day is our birthday. That's the net guy in volume one. Oh, thanks. Couldn't you just have put it magically on our bookshelf like the other stuff? Oh, this is Simon's wife, okay. Phoebe, uh, Bachelorette. Ah <laughs> ha uh -huh. Oh, come on! Okay, sure, why not? We have to deal with everyone's problems, so we might as well. All you gave me was a book. What a ripoff. Okay, I am starting to get a little tired now. So this will be the last segment for today, I think. Alright, now we can go in here. This is the carpenter's place, where Bo is apprenticing. And then after this I'm gonna let it off and then I'm just gonna take her back down to the to the to our house, our ranch. You I won't make you guys go through that, so don't worry about it. Wow that dog looks so cute and happy. Yeah, I'm looking at the dog and not the guy. <laughs> What's up? Oh, so these are the people we're gonna have to pay to fix up our house and stuff. Uh oh. Yeah, he's a bachelor too. You lost your son. Oh goodness. No sense of direction. Hmm, who does that remind you of? Uh, I'm actually thinking of Ryoga from uh, Rama One Half, but never mind. <laughs> Dale. Okay, hi Dale. Boss. Is he the boss of you? Ha ha ha. Already tried to go there, remember? The animals. The, 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 the. So 
So yeah, I think to get that in motion, you have to go to huge forests and check the door and see. Oh my gosh, it's locked! How the heck did we get it open? I have to do stuff to get it open. But I, uh, yeah, I'll be more clear talking about it next time. Oh, sorry about that. So uh, we're gonna leave it here. Hope you've enjoyed this installment of Let's Play Harvest Moon Animal Parade. I've been Shirahime, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!